attorney Jonathan Elson, reminding you that if you've been injured in an auto accident, it's important to have somebody on your side. When you need a lawyer, when you need Nelson. You need Nelson. Everyday life is they're running through my property, tearing up the trash. I'm constantly picking up trash, terrorizing my dog. They're, they, they just poop in my yard. They're just living in my yard. You know, and I get tick I got had back surgery two months ago and I'm constantly having to pick up trash and my boyfriend he goes to work at two o'clock in the morning and there's been times where those dogs have been on our property and has barked at them and started coming towards them like they were gonna attack them. So do you guys have a fence in between your property or what? If you want to call it a fence, yes. She's put up lattice and um, two by fours and stuff, try to keep from the dog going over and they just they crawl over or they go under the fence and do you guys talk uh i haven't talked to her but a couple times and i've asked her and i've asked her i said please can you keep your dogs off my property because they're destroying my property they get in the trash and they get into other things and you know it's getting to be rather i'm getting pissed off um three years of insanity and you know enough to where I almost broke up my marriage and um she's uh it's hard. My uh, first experience was in December, I think, of 2013. My husband, always with dogs on leash, uh -huh. walking the dogs, as he always does. Sixteen dogs come running around the corner straight for him. And my husband has one lung, or a, uh, an impaired calcified lung. Mm -hmm. And um, he just hunkered down and prayed they wouldn't, you know. And luckily, they, he screamed until he was hoarse for like a week. But they diverted and went around him. But this was a daily occurrence. I have grandchildren that can't go out and play. I've had to buy a gate. I've had to shut the gate because it was massive amounts until that year and something ago when we did the raid and got Channel 13 involved too. And they did the raid and do you think it was going to be good? No, they let her have five dogs. And then when they gave her back those five dogs, they weren't sterilized? Is that what's uh, the, As far as I know, there's, you're allowed to have breeding pairs. Um, we all arrived um, about, I think the court, court time was 1.30. Mm -hmm. At about 1.40, she was still not there. She's notorious for being late. And uh, the judge just wasn't tolerating it anymore. So. What judge was this? I believe it was Whitaker. And so... Um, she didn't show up to court. What happened at that point? Um, at that point in time, there was a Nobel warrant issued, and she was arrested, I think, about 5 o'clock in front of her house. 